Let's go over tennis ball self myofascial release for the whole hamstrings. The hamstring originates off your ischial tuberosity, which is pretty inside there, pretty close to your butt. Uh, so we're going to start the ball there, and we're going to work inside to outside as we work down towards the knee. So again, we're starting the, the ball here under your hip, uh, pretty close to your butt, and we're going to start rolling inside to outside and towards the knee at the same time. Um, we might find some tight spots and some soft spots that are sort of press on, but that's okay. When we find those spots, I want you to stop, and I want you to extend the knee, and I want you to try and pull tissue past that tight spot and past that spot that's sort of press on. We can also rotate the femur, so we're working that femur inside to outside and changing the angle of your foreleg, if you want to think of it that way. And again, working towards that knee, uh, stopping when we find tight spots, and extending the leg. You might find a couple spots that are pretty sore to press on and that you can't get that leg to extend all the way. And it's okay to find those spots, it's okay to work on them, and we want to actually improve the flexibility of that hamstring muscle while we're doing this drill. Uh, this is great for getting, again, those hamstrings more flexible, which helps us in the workouts because it lets us express a better position in the workouts because we're not being affected by those tight hamstrings as much. Um, and it might be sore. It might take a couple of times doing this drill to get those hamstrings to start loosening up. Uh, but do it consistently, uh, consciously, trying to get that knee to extend all the way, trying to hit good positions with that hamstring muscle, and it'll get better. So you all have fun doing that.